Well, what happened? I mean, did we get out of Lavos in time? Oh, great. This is the new game plus that I've heard so much about? Oh, oh there we are. Oh, it's instead this time a soldier. This is, let me guess, this is supposed to be like a, a nightmare or something? Well, now they want to... But that, that was the fake chancellor. I saved the kingdom. You, you said I could stay. You, you said everything would be cool, dude. Uh, we took her to 65 million BC. No. Well, yeah, we did. But other than that, uh, we were back in time and everything. Yeah, I mean... We saved the world, right? Oh, he already knows about that. Well, how could that be? Hey, it's, uh, Doan. Oh, what are you doing here? And the old king? How did all these guys get here? And Kino? Well... Davos actually beat the Reptites, but other than that... Luca! You're the one who brought them all here, aren't you? I just said that. Great job, Luca! You're totally gonna hose the future now, you know? You fuse it? Oh, fussing. I thought he said fusing about his kingdom. <laughs> uh, I'm dyslexic, I guess, or... Something. Whatever. Yay! We get to go to the Moonlight Parade! Alright! We get a celebration and ending fit for a hero, I guess. Is that one of my kitties over there? Better not be. I've been feeding them this whole game. Yeah, as if there's such a thing as normal. I love the music for the ending here. It's just so cheerful. I mean, that's one thing I loved about doing this Let's Play series. It was so cheery and fun and silly and everything. It was great. I mean, it has everything you'd want in a game. Just so much fun. I had a lot of fun with this Let's Play series. And we got all these balloons, and what are those little girls? Oh, well, I, I guess they're blowing kisses to me, since I saved the world, after all. Sorry, ladies, but I'm a one-on-one -on -one kind of guy. You know, there's not enough H.C. Bailey to go around for everyone. Sorry, sorry. Th that's some short parade. Okay, well, let's walk around and talk to some people. There's Tabin. Oh, he likes some lemonade. And... All right. And that must be Lara. And since we uh, freed, or since we saved Lara's legs from the, the accident there, she can actually stand up and walk around. But otherwise, I think she'd just be sitting down or something or whatever. That's nice that you saved the world, but I wish you'd be home and call me every now and then. I was feeding the cat. I, I was around occasionally. Well, we can send you back to 12,000 BC, although I don't know if you'd really want to anymore, but okay, fair enough. And now let's just follow Luca up here. Magus may or may not be here, depending on, well, whether you killed him or not. Now everyone has to go back home. The gate is growing weak. We must say our goodbyes now, before it's too late! Now we have to say goodbye to Isla and Kino. Well, I guess if they're girls, they, uh would be pretty strong, like Isla. Hey, what do you mean by that? Ayla good in bed. Kino dummy. I'll teach him. 
And there go. Okay. Well, yeah, that's right. We got the king. We gotta say goodbye to. Aww. I love this part of the ending too, because it's you know it's just nice and heartwarming and everything. You gotta say goodbye to everyone, and <laughs> Mr. Frog. Long farewells never were necessary. Ah, the only kiss in the game, I think. Well, besides Isla's kiss, Tech. Well, thanks for the kiss, but bye! I'm gonna find the girl back home. Megus is going to search for Scala? What do you mean? Oh yeah, that's right, we kinda left her back there at the Ocean Palace, didn't we? Aw, oh, nuts. Now, well, wait a minute, can Robo go home? The future would... Luca to totally hosts the future. Would the future still be there? Oh. Well, yeah, well, time travelers are immune to the effects of tampering with the timeline. Aw, oh, Robo has emotions. Oh. Okay, well, let's get going then, Robo. Goodbye. Whoa, watch it, Robo. <laughs> Robo can cry. <laughs> cry with oil. Bye bye. And the gate will close, and that'll be it. So, unless someone's gonna come out of the gate. Ah, The entity is finally at rest. And dismantle the epoch. We don't want anyone abusing the... <laughs> wow, that's a lot of cats. They're all the same color now, too. I didn't expect them all to meow like that. All my cats are running away? <laughs> I, I shouldn't be laughing, but... It's terrible! <laughs> the gate's not gonna open again. Whatever are we gonna do now? We gotta go after the kitties. But the gate's closed. What are we gonna do now? Oh, right, we have a time machine. But I guess it's a good thing we didn't dismantle the epoch after all. Well, I guess we could see the king real quick. We have one more adventure to go on, Dad. Sorry. Uh, well, we gotta go after the cats and, well, Kano's mom and everything, so. Oh, they got a new bell. Okay, Nadia's bell. I, I think he said that's what it was. Oh, well, okay. Sorry, I spoiled the name of the bell two seconds after they said it. Wow, he can lift that bell all the way over his head. That's uh, pretty strong. 